you guys do a lot of themed episodes. Like, I actually think your serious theme episodes are always your best. What do you can you uh, clue to us for or give us a hint for this season? Well, I mean, we kind of uh, spent this season in a more grounded way. Like, we're getting to know the characters. It's a, it's a darker season, uh, but we got that timeline episode. If you like that. Uh, you'll probably like the video game episode that's going to uh, come up. And then there's a Law & Order episode uh, that where we uh, do the episode in the style of Law & Order. I'm smirking because you had this dead look on your face. So I was uh, p- uh, pitching that to you. You were like, yeah. Law & Order could be good. I did like your timeline one. That was very good. Yeah. I like your sci-fi ones, and I like the Doctor Who-ish episodes. Yeah. But if they took away all budget constraints, you could do anything you wanted for a theme base, what would it be? Uh, God, that's a good question. No, uh, if they took away all... If I had infinite money... God, what's really expensive that we can't do because we don't have any money? I'm trying. I know there's a good answer to this question. Like, on location, I think, which is really expensive. Like, like, like being able to spend an entire episode outdoors, and not just like a the gang goes camping episode, but like just being able to do like a like an episode that sort of like like spans the city of Greendale uh, with people driving and going to multiple locations. I mean, that that's the stuff that costs a bazillion dollars that you could never do. So if I had, if, if, if the budget cap was taken off for one episode, I think I would use the money the wisest by by having an episode that took place during one day but spanned like uh, the entire city. That way, the entire world. Well. <laughs> yeah, I probably a twenty minute story. I think it would be. I'm fucking get your own show, Libya. I don't know. I'm, 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 I hate myself for not answering that question. Uh, uh, I, I have five answers to that question that I have to f- figure out tonight. I never really asked myself that. You're too good a journalist. Who's your favorite character of the ensemble? And you know the answer is Abed. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, Abed. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were actually gonna argue with me. Nah, nah. Uh, uh, but. Uh, I mean, because without him, I, I, I just, you know, I wouldn't be able to do the show. It'd be a different show. Uh, so he's got to be my favorite because, like, even though I would never want to have to choose if there was a fire, you know, and you wanted to escape with community, uh, he's the goldfish, you know. You're going to, uh, otherwise there's nothing, you know. Uh, they're all my favorite. 